Welcome to Deep Lizard. I'm Mandy, and if you've made it to this episode, then congratulations on reaching the end of the Deep Learning with TensorFlow course. Throughout the course, we've learned how to leverage the TensorFlow library along with its integrated Keras API to do so many different things for us, including processing data sets and building and training neural networks, using those networks for inference, all the way to learning how to augment data sets and fine tune neural networks and apply transfer learning from a pre existing network to another one. So as we've been able to experience ourselves throughout this course, making use of a neural network API like TensorFlow allows us to quickly and efficiently experiment with data sets and neural network architectures and training processes. So I hope that you have enjoyed this course and that you've been able to extract a lot of value from it. You're now equipped to take what we've learned here and go apply it to your own projects. In this course, we've only scratched the surface of what all is possible with deep learning and making use of deep learning APIs like TensorFlow. So be sure to head over to deeplizzard.com to check out all of the available courses there so that you can see what's most suitable for you for where to go next in your own deep learning journey. I look forward to seeing you again.